Hi, I'm Tim Bartz, Internet Sales Manager at Law MacArthur Lincoln in Salina, Kansas. In this video, we're going to walk around the outside and take a look at the inside of this brand new 2017 Lincoln Navigator L. Now, this is your select four-wheel drive. Uh, in this video, we're going to go over all the equipment that's ordered on this particular vehicle. It is headed to our new lot as soon as we get down here. So, uh, this video I'm going to go over, it's specific to this vehicle, so I'm going to go over all the equipment that was ordered on this. Now, this was a select. There was two optional um, equipment added to this. One is the moonroof and one is the wheels. So we'll get to both of those in just a little bit. Uh, starting here on the outside, this is your black velvet metallic paint color and it does have your ebony interior as well. Uh, underneath the hood you have that 3.5 liter uh, V6 twin turbocharged engine with your six speed select shift transmission. Uh, now this in here does have some great equipment here on the front as well. It does have a nice uh, satin chrome grille with a chrome surround that goes around these automatic HID headlights. Also does have your LED fog lights down here. Front sensing system as well. So as you're pulling into garages and parking lots, you're going to have that uh, feature too. It alerts you as you get closer and closer to items uh, and different uh, things in the garage, parking spaces, that kind of thing, uh, just like your backup sensors will. Uh, it does have a nice chrome accent here on the front part of that bumper too. So real nice look uh, to the vehicle uh, that I think you'll like on this particular one. Uh, now also this does have some uh, really nice uh, daytime running lights, so the signature lighting as we like to call it. It's these LED lights underneath those headlights. Uh, you're going to have those uh, turn on. You can set it up in your settings to have those uh, double as your daytime running lights. It looks real sharp when you're coming down the road. Uh, so it really lights up those LED lights underneath and I believe even these uh, lights down here too. So, uh, so it looks uh, real sharp and I think you really appreciate it here on the front of the vehicle. Now moving around to the side is where you're going to see one of the optional equipments that we put on this select uh, trim and that is these uh, nice 22 inch 20 spoke premium painted aluminum wheels so real nice wheel I love the 20 spoke on the 22 inch wheel I think it really fills it up uh, makes it look real nice uh, this particular vehicle does have your pearly tires on it as well uh, so a uh, real good uh, tire uh, for you and it would look really good grip on that. Now over here on the side you do get power deployable running boards so uh, what's great about those is those running boards do deploy down a little bit lower than most of your running boards making it easier for those kids to get in and out of the vehicle. Also when you uh, shut the doors it's going to go ahead and tuck that underneath. Looks real sharp on the side so it almost looks like a part of the vehicle and it also protects the top of those running boards from ice and snow and that kind of thing during those uh, inclement weather uh, situations so keeping that free of that and not having that the slick running board so it looks real sharp. Now this does have a really nice uh, intelligent access with security approach lamps so you're going to see that uh, there. Uh, what it allows you to do is it puts that nice welcome mat beside the vehicle so use your keyless entry uh, from a distance it's going to do that. Also it does have your keypad here on the door uh, so you could use the keypad to get in and out of the vehicle because you don't have to get the keys out once you do get inside to start the vehicle so that's another uh, way to be able to do that. It does have your turn signal indicator here on the mirror just allows for people in the blind spot to know that you're wanting to turn. Uh, also it does have your power heated mirror and your auto dimming driver side mirror uh, that comes in handy. It's going to automatically dim your uh, mirror when those cars with those bright lights want to pass you. And this has your bliss system. That's that blind spot information system. And so if there's someone in your blind spot, it's going to put a light in the corner of that mirror and let you know it's not safe to go in that lane at that time. Also, as you're backing up, it uses a cross traffic alert. So if someone's going to cross your path behind you, it's going to put a light in the mirror on the side that they're coming from, message on the dash, and a series of tones that it's not safe to back up. So a uh, real nice uh, system. I love the blind spot monitoring system with the cross traffic alert. They go really nicely together here. Now this does also get remote start, so you can have that. You can start the vehicle from the comfort of your home. Also privacy glass here on these side win windows. Looks real nice, but also keeps it cooler for those in the second and the third row seat. Nice chrome accented roof rails up there with the black crossbars. Nice chrome accent underneath the windows, just dresses everything up along with the chrome door handle. So, well, real sharp look here on the side. Uh, let's go ahead and move to the back now and show you some of the features on the back of the vehicle. Now, moving to the back, you're going to see your rear defrost back here, also rear wiper. It has a nice chrome accent across there, right below the nice LED tail lights. So you're going to see those LED lights come on clear across the back there. People are going to be able to know that you're wanting to break. Just, just a great look and the LEDs are so much brighter as well. And I love the nice big Lincoln lettering on these navigators, a little bit bigger than your other vehicles. Has your rear view camera with reverse sensing, so just like your front sensor as you're backing up, it's going to alert you if you get too close to anything. And the rear view camera allows you to be able to see behind you. This does have your tow package with your Clash 4 receiver hitch. 
four pin uh, and seven pin wiring, I believe. Uh, what's great about that is it has more towing capacity on this vehicle, on the uh, this uh, Navigator, than any other vehicle in this class. So I think 8,500 pounds towing capabilities with that. Uh, now you'll see it does have this cover on there. Real nice and easy, two finger screws. You can just uh, uh, turn those, it's gonna come out, and then you could stow that away. So I, I like uh, this uh, cover because you don't have to worry about hitting your shins on it, also, uh, or getting your pants dirty or anything like that. So when you're not using it, just put that on there, real nice and easy to use. Now this does have a couple different uh, ways to get inside the rear cargo area. And one of those is you can uh, press, you can open this glass right here just by pressing the button between the L and the N. So right under there, you just press that and it's going to open it so you can uh, get in access to the back. So if you need to get something out of the top or maybe you load it up uh, really good with luggage, uh, you still need to put a couple things in there, you can uh, use that, the glass to get into it. Also it does have your power lift gate, so you can use your remote. Uh, from a distance to open it up. There's also a button on the inside, so if you're inside the vehicle and you want to open the lift gate up for the kids getting stuff in the back, you can do that as well. Or you can just uh, press this button between the C and the O here, and it's going to open it up as well. And I think that works only when the vehicle's unlocked. Now here in the rear cargo, I'm going to show you this. This does have a, the, the L, which is your extended length, so some uh, great flexibility on this. Uh, one of those is it has this cargo management system, and I really love this. It's a divider and a shelf all in one. So it does have a couple hinges there. You can just pull that up, put it in place, and it locks in there. And it gives you a divider, so you can put some uh, luggage, and it helps you div divide that luggage up uh, and organize a little bit better. Also, you can then take it out of those. You can flip it up on those hinges and then put it into place and it creates a shelf as well. So uh, it does have a 30 pound limit on that shelf, but what's great about that too is if you have some luggage, you want to put some, you need more luggage in there, you can put some things down there and it gives you a little bit uh, deep well in here to put some things in, but also then it helps you manage that a little bit better. So you can put those smaller bags up there and they're not smashing down on the other bag. So I re really love the cargo management that they put in these. Now also because this does have a rear independent suspension, you get a couple of flexibilities that way. One of those uh, is you have a great ride of course for that rear independent suspension it's going to be able to get hit those potholes and and not have to uh, make that the vehicle lean but also you get the uh, th full flat third row seat what's great about this is you don't have to pull the seats out if you need to put some extra luggage in there uh, and it folds completely flat to the floor so 60 40 split bench seat you can seat three in that third row seat uh, and then you could fold one side or another down, which I, I love the capabilities of that because then you can still seat two in that back seat if you just have something longer that you want to put in that other side. So it really helps with managing that. Now let me demonstrate exactly how this works. First thing you're going to want to do is going to want to pull the lever behind for that headrest because you want to lay that headrest down. It won't fold completely flat. And then what's great about this in 2017, you just press these buttons here on the side. You can press the left, the right, or you can hit the middle one. It's going to do both. So we'll just do the left side. So you just press the button. And you just press it once and it's going to go ahead and uh, fold it down. And in previous years you had to press and hold that button. Uh, in 2017 you just press it once and it's going to fold completely flat into the floor. Uh, flat load level. And what's really great about the second row seats too is those outside seats. Uh, you can lay the, the seat, seats down a little bit and it's going to be a little bit elevated but it has a little lever on the back. So you just pull that lever and push the seat down and it's in that cargo mode. It's what they call it. And that gives you that flat load level all the way up to that front seat. So you're going to be able to put anything really long in here. I uh, should be able to fit a, a long 2x4 in there that, you know, uh, the full length ones, the uh, 8 foot ones. So I, I think you'll really appreciate the uh, flexibility here in the back of the vehicle. Now moving to the in interior here, this for the trim, you do have this in black and there's the ebony interior in here uh, with your Bridge of Wear leather seating surfaces. And then you have your brown swirl walnut trim here on the instrument panel, your steering wheel in the doors. So real nice look and interior trim to this vehicle. Now there's a feature that's uh, really nice when you get in and out of the vehicle and it's called the easy entry and exit seat. Uh, now you can turn this on and off in your settings. Uh, I have it turned on right now and what's great about it is uh, just like you sound, it makes it a little bit easier getting in and out of the vehicle. When you shut the vehicle off it's going to electronically move that seat back and the steering wheel up and out of, out of the way so it's a little bit easier to get in and out of the vehicle. And then when you get in and you press the uh, push button start to start the vehicle, which is that, so you don't get the keys out of your pocket, you'll see it puts that seat back in position, the steering wheel down and forward, and that's going to put it in the position for the la last person that drove this is does have power or driver memory for two different drivers, so you're going to be able to, to set that, those uh, the settings. So as soon as you start the vehicle, it's going to move it into position, and then when you shut it off again, uh, then it's going to go ahead and, and 
bring the seat back and the steering wheel up and out of position. So that what's great about this, it does have that power tilt and telescoping feature. Uh, so it allows for that capabilities. And the driver memory not only works on the uh, steering wheel, your seat, but also your mirror over here too. So uh, that's a real nice uh, little system here. Now here in the front seat, you get these uh, front bucket seats. There are 10-way power seats, including a power lumbar for each of these seats, heated and cooled seats up here. Second row gets the uh, bucket seats back there. They're heated on the outside as well, on um, both those seats. And then you're going to have the uh, climate control settings right behind the console for those in the second row to be able to control the climate for those in the back. And then you have your third row 60-40 split bench seat for the uh, we're seat and three back there, just like we talked about earlier. Now here in the door, you do have your power windows, box, and mirror switches. Also does have power mirror features, so you can pull that uh, mirror down or pull the lever down. It's going to bring those mirrors in towards the glass. Also, this does have your power adjustable pedals that go along with your power tilt and telescoping steering wheel. So the power pedals are going to bring those pedals forward and back. And then you can see the leather wrap steering wheel with the wood finish. Cruise control on the left side of the steering wheel with Bluetooth and audio controls on the right side of the steering wheel. As I mentioned earlier, you do have your push button start. Also here on the instrument panel, it uh, does have some nice buttons here on the lower part of that lower row. You're going to have your power lift gate uh, button. Also, you do have your 4x4 shift on the fly with two wheel drive, four auto, and four high. And it has your hill descent mode and your traction control where you can turn that off as well right there. And then for your climate control, you have dual zone auto climate control. So the driver and front passenger can have two different temperatures. And I like that your heated and cooled uh, buttons are right there for the uh, driver and front passenger so you don't have to pull that up on that screen. For entertainment, you have AM, FM, CD player with Sirius satellite. GHX certified audio sound system as well, and it has the new Sync 3 system. That's that third, third generation voice enhanced recognition system. Check out the video that I have on our YouTube channel under the how to videos, exactly how this works, how to connect your phone, how to use the whole system. And you can control your phone, your entertainment, your climate, and your navigation. This does have the full navigation with the screen. Uh, and even the, the new screen has the pinch to zoom capabilities, a lot like your smartphone. I think you'll really appreciate how that works. And then when you put that vehicle in reverse, that backup camera I mentioned earlier, it's going to come up on that full 8-inch screen uh, right there, uh, nice and easy to be able to see. Now up here in the mirror, you do get auto dimming rear view mirror. You get garage door openers for three different garage doors on the visor. And this does have the optional uh, package, the power moonroof with the manual sunshade that we put on this vehicle. Uh, so it's always uh, real nice. A lot of people like that. And it has the ambient lighting. It lights up your cup holders, your footwells, uh, even the footwell back there in the uh, second row. Uh, so I think you'll uh, really like it. You can change the colors on that as well through your settings on that Sync 3 screen. So great equipment on this. Uh, select uh, a four-wheel drive comes. Uh, that's where the, uh, the starting level is for uh, the Navigator. And uh, I think you're going to really love all the equipment that's on this vehicle. And that select on a lot of our other models is the most popular uh, package. Uh, so I think you will like all the equipment that's on this vehicle. Now check out some of the great benefits when you buy a new Lincoln. One of those is uh, you get the four year, 50,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty. Also go along with the same uh, term as a four year, 50,000 mile pickup delivery. So if you live within 30 miles from a Lincoln dealership, like here at Long MacArthur Lincoln, you're gonna get pickup delivery service. So they're gonna pick your vehicle up for service, leave you a Lincoln loaner for the day, service your vehicle, detail it inside and out, and bring it back to you. And uh, that's a great service. You can have that set up to pick up uh, from your home or work. You know, you can just drive on to work, and once you get to work, you can just have a uh, schedule to pick up right there. And then uh, if you happen to need a vehicle for your lunch hour, then go ahead and uh, drive that Lincoln vehicle they, they've dropped you, and then they'll bring it back to you before you get off work. So great uh, way to service your vehicle without being inconvenienced whatsoever. Also, you get a six-year, 70,000-mile powertrain warranty. Uh, so some great uh, warranties to go along with that. We also throw in two free oil changes, and we actually include the works package. That's an oil change, tire rotation, and a multi-point inspection in that first uh, year of service when you bring it into Long MacArthur. Uh, and then, of course, even if you uh, don't have your uh, take care of the pickup and delivery or take advantage of that, we, we if you bring your vehicle for service, every time you bring it in, you're still going to get a full detail inside and out, as well as a free loan or anytime you have any major maintenance, you're going to be without a vehicle. So, And that's always going to be a Lincoln vehicle, too. So, You're also going to get 10% off any accessories through our aftermarket department. So great way to add some maybe all-weather mats or some window tint to the vehicle and save some money that way. You can find our new and our used inventory on our Lincoln website, LawMacArthurLincoln.com. There in each one of our vehicles, you can check for availability, schedule a test drive. You can see pictures as well as original window sticker on the new vehicles you can pull up. And all of our new uh, used vehicles, you're going to see the equipment list uh, as well there. If you have any questions, uh, you want to schedule a test drive, you can call or send us a text message at 785 
378-5031. And I hope you enjoyed this video on this 2017 Lincoln Navigator L.